I couldn't be happier to be on the water that day. Everything was just right. The water was flat calm, the sun was shiny, and we were about to go catch some red snapper. Man, one drop, you got half your limit. Do one more drop and we're done. Exactly. <laughs> I love eating red snapper. It's tender white meat, super delicious, and fighting them, it's a lot of fun too. Get it. Oh, there it is. Good job. Good. <laughs> Woo! This is so much fun on this light reel. Run. Another red snapper for the cooler. I just tossed one Look right how many of them are right there. Oh, that's all Woo, the there he goes. He gets another one. <laughs> Woo, look at that school down there. My gosh, look at them all in the water. Nice size. That's good eating size right there. That's good eating size. Might have me. I don't know. I'll we'll see. <laughs> what do you guys one. think? Yeah. Tell you what, with all these fish here, I'm gonna let this one go. What is that? Get a bigger one. There he goes. Let that one go. Super fun fight. We only had three days to catch these red snappers, and they're everywhere. People were pretty upset, so now we got 39 more days to catch them. For snapper fishing, fluorocarbon is very necessary, and uh, we were using 40 pound Yozuri top knot leader. Good job. <laughs> Ooh, you got a good one. You got a real good one. We kept releasing the snapper because we already had our limit and uh, we, we were all the way in 50 feet of water, like I said, and we didn't want to just catch our limit and go home, so we kept catching and releasing them just for fun. I can tell you one thing, as long as your line was in the water, you would catch a fish that day. We got to our spot and we could see them literally all around the boat on the surface and uh, we knew it was going to be a great day. 